Wow. Wow, 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 wow. Wow. Lunch lease. Another scam from another YouTuber. Something, as I, I saw this tweet, and as a European, as an Englishman, slightly different, whatever. I find it really quite baffling all these like lunch leaves like people eat them like we used to have things you dip in cheese and shit i've never had shit like that and i would never have shit like that in my life but if you're not seen logan paul i eat lunch leaf for breakfast lunch and dinner what a lucky man hey what a lucky man he is he must be you know he's got massive biceps massive ball sacks probably i'm just presuming and it's because he eats brick lunch leaves for breakfast lunch and dinner he's a legend but have you seen what the fuck is in lunch leaves hey Hey? God damn. These are molded. Okay, so these ones are supposed to be good until December, and we just got them from the store. This is used by December 8th, 2024. And so clearly we're going to be in date, and they're moldy as cheese. Now, this is a huge thing on Twitter, online. Everyone's going nuts, like, holy shit. I think this is the end of Lunchly already. Honestly, no one's going to buy them. They're all going to get refunded because the cheese has gone moldy. Logan Paul, KSI, Mr. Fucking Queef, they are nowhere to be seen. They have gone, they've disappeared, they've gone AWOL, bro. They're not even here to have a discussion, man. Not even here. Because they know they're in deep shit. Now, to me, this is a scam. It is a scam. That is not a healthy meal and no nutritional value in that whatsoever. Um, I'm just, you know, it, this, this, they can pretend like, oh, we're doing this for that. No, they're, making, they're taking a piss out of their audience because they know the little kids are going to run to their mums. Mummy and daddy, oh, I need this, all oh, the cool kids have them, oh, it's KSI, it's Logan Paul, it's what all the YouTubers have, if I don't eat these, I'll never have big biceps and I'll never, I'll never fit in at school. That's what they are preying on and trying to manipulate people so they feel parents are forced to buy this shit for their kids at lunchtime. This type of stuff is not bought, KSI never had this because we don't eat shit like that really, I've never seen it, like it's an American thing. You get out, your whole lunch is on plastic nasty container, never mind a lunch, it's moldy fucking cheese bro. Today's date is October 16th, so these are supposed to be good for like another two months. This is molded. That's mold. This is not safe, especially like kids that are so young, they may not know what mold looks like. So they might Exactly, so kids might have eaten that and thought it was normal. If you don't know who this lady is, she was actually on Mr. Beast's one of her things and never got paid or something like that and had a big beef. So... Yeah, I agree. It's it's um, it's hilarious how it's her who's got it. I agree. You know, a lot of questions being asked, but you can't fake that. The packet was shut. The date was on it. You know what I mean? You can't fake that. Why would you fake that? She doesn't look like someone would fake it. She's there to make a video. So Logan Paul eats moldy cheese for breakfast, lunch, and dinner. That was the point of that. But as you can see here, there's multiple videos, multiple pictures. Obviously, this is just a collage. Someone, you know, very talented, stuck them all together. Mold, 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 mold. I mean, that is just a depressing meal. I'm so sorry if your parents buy it. Like, I'm so sorry. So I know money's tight, but these aren't cheap either. I am so sorry if that was, you know, I'd rather have a ham sandwich. And I've had them for five to ten years. I'm sick of ham sandwiches. You know what I mean? Like, that is... Uh, <laughs> Dear fucking stars, ten. Dear fucking Dustin, just opened my first lunch ever. So much mould. What flavour mould did you guys get? So yeah, they've not said a word. Of course they haven't because they're embarrassed. They're ashamed of what they've done. They're promoting this to little kids to be healthy. Blah, 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 blah. And instead, they're robbing people of their money. I mean, it's a disgrace. It's an absolute disgrace. Not only have you pushed a product that is a scam. You know, there's nothing healthy about a bit of bread, cheese, and some fucking processed meat. All right, nothing not no, 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 zero nada nelch none you're now giving people moldy cheese i think this is the end of lunch lease um it lasted maybe two weeks but i have no problem against like you know youtubers get sponsors sponsors are good sponsors should because it promotes youtubers it promotes businesses it's a good you know it's a good thing but this is like dipping your oar in something you don't do it's like me getting sponsored by like i don't know a gun shop the fuck do I know about guns, bro? What do I know? I'm simply doing it for the money. You know what I mean? Let's say, I don't know, you know, it, when people sponsor by G Fuel, that's understandable because you're a gamer. You probably drink coffee, caffeine, you know, stuff like that. You, you, your community drinks caffeine. They might even drink G Fuel. So you're giving something to them that they're going to use. This is just a manipulation tactic by Logan Paul, KSI, all them twats, because they know, just like it did with Prime, their parents had to buy them it because they want to make... They, Everyone wants their kids to be happy and looked after and well catered for. So they're going to go, oh, 
they're going to give in eventually and go, oh, fine, I'll, I'll buy you one, this, that, and the other. And then the parents might go, hold on, this is easy for lunch. I'll just throw that in and they're happy as Larry. You know, it's completely... And they can pretend it's not, oh, we wanted to make a healthy... Auto- Shut the hell up, mate. It actually upset, like, actually upsets me what KSI has done because he used to be such a good YouTuber. Like, he used to actually want to entertain people, make people laugh, make people smile. You know, how many times you've been sad and watched a YouTuber and felt fucking better about it? Like, this is just rock bottom for me. Rock bottom. And he, yeah, what do I, you know, I'm like, who am I? You know what I mean? Fair enough. Who am I? But, you know, no one. But it's just sad to see the world. And, you know, it's all about, you know, again, no, nothing wrong with money. Everyone needs money. Everyone wants money. I get that. But this is, you know, there is no relevance to this to you other than that a lot of young kids might watch your audience and you know you can scam them of it. And that's what they're doing. This is what it is, isn't it? Luckily, us older people, we don't fall for shit like this. I, like, I was maybe going to buy a couple and just try them on, you know, film a, uh, film a video. But I ain't going to do that no more. Well, I might do, but, you know, I'm going to make sure there's no fucking blue cheese in it. And I saw someone comment, cheese is mouldy. That, what do they call it? Um, copiism. That's copiism. <gasps> My favourite. Low gang. Low gang. It can't be moldy. There's no more possible fucking way. You, what are you telling me? Prime's not good for you. Are you a fucking liar? Anyway, guys, don't buy lunch, Lee's. Or if you do, um, always check the cheese.